Hi, my name is Tim Schaefer. I'm the Executive Director of the Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission. Today I'm joined by Waterways Conservation Officer Doug Deppin and Commissioner Chad Saylor from the Dauphin County Board of Commissioners. And we're here along the banks of the Susquehanna River on a, on a chilly January day to remind people of the need to be safe on and along the water all year long. And the main message here today is to stay off of the frozen Susquehanna River. Uh, it's been a number of years since we've had conditions like this. It is a, a really pretty sight out there. We just had a gentleman stop down to take some pictures of the river. But we want to remind folks today, please, that water uh, that's underneath is extremely cold. The ice is thin. Please stay off of the Susquehanna River. I'm going to turn it over to Officer Deppin to give you some safety tips, things that he's seen from the field. Um, in addition to safety tips here on, uh, on the river, we can also give you some tips for when you're out on the ice this year on, on, on lakes and ponds. There's some great ice fishing that's happening all over Pennsylvania, but again, the Susquehanna River is not a place to try that out. And then we'll wrap up with Commissioner Saylor uh, for some safety tips here uh, pertinent to local in, in, here in Dauphin County. So with that, WCO Deppin. I'll start off by saying uh, if you want to go out and do some uh, sports on the ice, start out by uh, you know, doing fishing or skating and stuff like that on a pond or a lake where you don't have a lot of water current. Like the river here, uh, it's, the flow underneath the ice is, is real swift. There's a lot of air pockets in there. One area you'll get maybe six or eight inches of ice and the next step you might have a half inch. And if you step on that weak spot under an air pocket, over an air pocket, you're going to fall through. If you fall through, the current's going to take you downstream under the ice. You're not going to be reappearing. Um, when I pull into, say, one of our boat launches, I often see people walking out on the ice to take photos. That's definitely the wrong thing to do. Make sure you're staying on shore, not walking out in the ice on the river. Thank you. Good. Thanks, sir. Well, as I said, my name's Chad Saylor. I'm a Dauphin County Commissioner. Uh, and on behalf of my teammates, uh, Commissioner Mike Priest and Commissioner George Hartwick, I want to thank the PA uh, Boat and Fish Commission for bringing this issue, uh, this public safety issue, uh, uh, to a head. Every year we face this when the temperatures get cold and, and the, the river starts to freeze over. Uh, uh, this becomes an issue. And I think the message today is don't be stupid. This is not a uh, hiking trail. All right? The Susquehanna River is not meant for walking on. We've got uh, Fort Hunter Park right across the road here. We've got Wildwood. We've got a bunch of great parks. If you want to go walking, that's the place to do it. Don't do it here. The reality is in the last four weeks, we've had four emergency calls along the Susquehanna River. Two, in fact, in one day, uh, a man for some reason decided to uh, see how far he could go out on the ice uh, down by the courthouse on Front Street. Another is a woman who lost control of her dog. Uh, you know, it's dangerous, it's life-threatening, and uh, you're, you're, you're taking up the valuable time of our emergency responders who should not be responding to, to, to people who carelessly walk out on this ice. Don't be stupid, don't do it, find some other place to walk, don't do walking on the Susquehanna River. Thank you. So thanks Commissioner and Officer Deppin for the safety reminders. Um, as the water does, as, as the weather warms up in the, in the spring and later in the winter, reminder uh, that life jackets are required on all canoes and kayaks and boats under 16 feet when you are boating from November 1st through April 30th. Uh, trout season will be right around the corner. Um, when that does happen on April 2nd, your life jacket will be required if you're on a canoe or a kayak or a boat under 16 feet. Uh, the water, the air may be warming up in the stream in the spring, but that water will still be ice cold. So please um, enjoy all the Pennsylvania has to offer. Enjoy the beauty of winter, but please stay off the Susquehanna River. And cut. Any questions? Well, this was a lot of a lot of fun. Yeah. I just oh, have yeah. a question. <laughs> yeah. For Officer Deppin. Yeah. Is there any sort of penalty, if not for walking out on the river, for doing something dangerous that puts other people in danger? Uh, 
I would say probably at least a disorderly conduct charge. Um, if something happens to you, you know, you're risk you, re risking the lives of the people that are going to rescue if the ice does break.